HVTV presenteras av Invid. Intersport. Nybergs bil. Och Jönköpings energi. Um, I think this weekend was really good for us. Um, our first game wasn't our best game and obviously the score depicted that, but I think in the Sunday's game when we were in the third and it was 3-0 and we came back, I think that really shows a lot for our team and the resilience that we showed throughout that whole game was incredible. Yeah, what happened in, on Sunday? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, nobody gave up and uh, we just kept working and we didn't give them as much respect as we did in the first game, so I think that helped us a lot. When you were down by three, how was the feeling in the team? Um, everyone was still pretty positive. It was really good. We had girls stepping up and uh, saying a few things that in between the second and third that really uh, carried the momentum for us and we came out st really strong in the third so I think that was really good for us. Yeah, and when you turned the game around, mm -hmm. what was it? Yeah, it was an incredible feeling. Everyone on the bench and everyone on the ice and everyone that was a part of the team was really excited so I think that was really good. And it was against Lulio, yes. is that extra? Yeah, I mean that definitely makes it, it's an extra special feeling especially last year because we played them in the finals and I mean everyone thinks they're such a good team so it was extra special to beat them, yeah. And the trip home was also special, yeah, the trip tell home us about was, it. Yeah, <laughs> I mean we were at the airport for quite some time, we were unsure if our flight was going to get cancelled or not so we were probably at the airport for like four-ish hours and we finally made a home so it was nice. <laughs> yeah. Som inte alls var det om till Mrazova. Och så sitter kvitteringen Marchment precis efter det läget som Brynäs hade och HV är definitivt tillbaka. Och Henry Marchment är... 11 uh, games played. You're on fifth place in, in SDHL. Uh, how would you describe the start of this season? Um, I mean, I don't know if... It's the start that we wanted, but it's the start that we got. Um, I think we have two important games coming up. Obviously, we need to take three points from Gothenburg and uh, Yeargarden being only a few points ahead of us in fourth. That's a really important game, especially going into like the November break where we have a week off. So I think the next couple games are very important to get the points. What kind of start did you want? I mean, of course, being from last year, um, we had high expectations. We had a record-breaking season. So I think everyone was a little bit shocked that we're in fifth right now. but. Um, not much we can do about that now, just look into the future and try and win some more games. Can you see any difference between last year and this year in yeah, the play? Yeah, I mean, of course, we have a lot of injuries right now. Han Olsen, Tilke, Linnea just got hurt. So, I mean, of course, we're thinking of that, but there's not that much we can do about it with the girls we have. We just got to keep moving forward. 21 points in 11 games for you. Mm -hmm. This starting of the season is incredible for you. Yeah, yeah, it's been a really good start, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah. How would you describe your own play this this season? Yeah, I mean, I think it's been really well. We don't have so many forwards, so I think the, the ice time that me and my line mates are getting is definitely contributing to uh, the statistics. But um, yeah, I mean, it's been a really good start, so that's always a good feeling. Are you in better shape than even better shape than last year? Um, yeah, I would like to think so. Yeah, it was a good summer, that's for sure. Yeah. Uh, and the special teams for this team, you're second in power play and first in uh, in uh, penalty killing. Uh, how important is that? That's really important, I think, especially the penalty killing. Of course, if you have one man down, you don't let in any goals. That's obviously a big thing, especially in this league. There seems to be a lot of penalties every game, so special teams are such an important role, and I think that's where you can win and lose games. So that's really good statistics for us. Yeah, but yeah. now you're in fifth place. Is yes. there anything you have to improve to to get a, a higher place in the league? Um, I think we just need to go into every game the way we went into Sunday's game versus Lulio. I think uh, we just need to have a positive mindset and believe in ourselves, and then we'll be okay. And this weekend, uh, you're facing Gothenburg mm -hmm. uh, in Saturday here in Husqvarna Garden. Yep. Uh, Gothenburg, they're in last place. They're struggling for points. Mm -hmm. uh, how how is this weekend's game? Um, I think it's just really important for us to get three points. These are the the kind of games that are really important that you don't want to lose any points in. So I think we just need to go in it as we're playing a team that's in first place and come out with the three points, which would be nice. Det är typiskt Kennedy Marchment det där, men det är hennes lugn, trygghet. Hon utstrålar ju att jag äger isen. Hon gör det också, sannoliken 5-0 då. 